Hello, it's Nancy today. Um, I want to show you a way to keep your arms warm. Now, when I'm in the South and I buy clothes, they are only three-quarter length sleeves, blouses. But there is something that is called a gauntlet, which gives you the rest of this so that your arms can be warm. My friend, Noor, who is, um, make sure you're recording. Uh, my friend Noor lives in Dubai, and she's a Muslim, and she wears the black, um, I think it's called an abayu, abaya, anyway, I think the niqab is the thing that goes over your head, and the uh, abaya, and then there's a, anyway, it's the one that covers your whole head and all, and just your eyes show, imagine. Anyway, um, in case that um, in case as a Muslim you don't want any of your body to show, the sleeves, the arms up above your wrist often get exposed. So these are called gauntlets and they are made just to cover from your elbow to your wrist. So I just love them because for me, it makes my clothes able to, my, my three-quarter length blouses, I can, I can wear them and be warm all winter. Hang on, I'll show you. I'll pull it down properly. See? So it's nice and warm. So um, I only had one pair. And of course, you can't wear one pair all the time. So I, I went to the store. I, oh, first, I turned it inside out, and I realized that this is Jersey stretching and the lace is also stretchy lace I would like to make that lace you know that would not be too terribly hard as a um, bobbin lace maker you could do that anyway so um, so I wanted to make them so I went to the store and I got myself some stretchy fabric which turns out to be jersey or t-shirt material so you could make these out of used t-shirts if you wish. And I got yellow. I was looking for white, but they didn't have white. And, oh, no, I actually was looking for yellow to go with my clothes. Remember, I dyed all my clothes. Well, I had all I had nine blouses and five skirts that were white that I was going to wear to the temple, but I never did use them. I, I always had a temple dress. So I dyed them all yellow. Those have become my, see, here's my yellow wardrobe. Anyway, so... So these were so easy to make. Let me see if I can just explain this to you. I I I think I bought a quarter meter. So that must have been about a quarter of a meter. And first thing I did was I I I cut them to fit. So I laid it out, I laid this one out. And then I cut a little longer for the seam. This is a fold, so I didn't I could just cut alongside it. Cut a little longer for the seam and a little longer for the hem. And here, there is no hem. So there I had it. And so I just, first I sewed the lace on to the short side. And I sewed it on the outside. This isn't as wide lace as this one. The wide lace is really pretty on your hand, on your wrist. Anyway, so I sewed the lace on and then I sewed up the seam from the lace down, and then I hemmed it on the machine. Well, I just sewed it across and hemmed it. And there you have it. And so now I have these amazing gauntlets that keep my arms, that keep my arms warm. And the whole thing cost me, I don't know, a quarter of a meter, so that's not very much, plus the lace. So for under $10, I was able to make three pairs of these. So there they are. Isn't that nice? They're called, if you buy them, they sold in Muslim food stores. Muslim food stores, grocery stores, off, or they're called Middle East foods. They often have all kinds of dish, dishwares and just many things. And they also have these, and they're called hand sleeves or gauntlet. This is made in China. Anyway, so I bought a pair. I went in Toronto. I was 
I don't know how these got dirty when the package wasn't open, but I must have done it. Somehow I can ruin everything. Anyway, so these are pink, but pink doesn't, so this is the part that must go at the wrist because it's, you know. So those are called hand sleeves or gauntlets. And you can make these at home out of old t-shirts and a piece of lace. So if you're, if you often get your arms are not covered or they're, um, the wind gets up under your blouse and you just like a little more under, on this part of your arm. Or sometimes they have sweaters. I can never understand this. Short sleeve sweaters. Like if it's cold enough to wear a sweater. You don't want short sleeves. Short sleeves, I don't think. I want it warm. But anyway, if you've got three quarter length clothes that you can't wear because they are not keeping your arms warm, you can make these gauntlets. So there you have it. You can do this at home. Results may differ. And you saw it here last. Bye.